I am ever astonished, I suppose I shouldn't be, by some of the responses to a sort of statement that Putin lies and that Putin has been bombing Ukraine, although he said he was going to stop. That is the reality. The fact that Liz Truss is also a liar, that Biden is also a liar, is neither here nor there. Yes, they are. The fact that Biden is useless, the fact that Liz Truss is useless, doesn't make Putin any more useful. This is not a relative discussion. And it's completely, um, it's, it, it, it's completely sort of out of the range. It, it, it's, it's a nonsense. Um, Larissa, who, who, whose comments I very much appreciate, writes, uh, you did not mention how many people have died these days due to shelling from the Ukrainian side. Putin said that in case of any attack on the territory of Russia, Russia will respond. And Belgorod area, Russia, is permanently shelled by HEMAs. It is not Putin, but Ukraine and collective West are liars. Britain, along with NATO states, that the part states are the participants of this war. You are not naive, and your statement about Putin is deceitful. No, my state statement about Putin is quite correct. And uh, I don't also, incidentally, regard naivety as a failing. I regard it as a virtue. So the, the various assumptions which are made here are simply wrong. Simply wrong. Uh, I, I, will, I, I will simply write, it's not relative to these sort of comments. I will read them. I greatly appreciate them. But, you know, look at the rest of my feed if you want to know what I think of Liz Truss and our government. The fact that Putin is a liar doesn't make our, our government any more virtuous. And the fact that our government is lying and useless doesn't make Putin any better. These things are independent of one another.